Hi, this is Joanne Allenbaugh with Farms.com, and we are visiting with Michael Beard, who is an Indiana soybean producer and who serves on the board of the United Soybean Board. One of your slogans here at the Ag Media Summit is that you love animals. Tell us why you love animals. We love animals because livestock are the number one customer of the best domestically raised soybeans. Those that, by that I mean by those that are kept within the confined borders of the United States. Uh, we do, of course, export about half of our soybeans out of the out of the country. Those soybeans, we are told, also go for animal feed. Actually, uh, feed of those that 90% of those soybeans are fed animals. So uh, we love animals, whether they're here or abroad. But we prefer that those the animals we have here domestically stay here domestically. Uh, 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 Food raised in this country, uh, consumed in this country, is better for all of us, safer and more affordable. And even though a great majority of the soybeans produced go to livestock production, there have been a lot of new uses for soybeans as well. We can start and talk all day about new uses and potential new uses. Well, We're new uses for combines that we combine the grain with, for the for the fuel that goes in those combines, for the seats and the trucks and the cars that uh, take the soybeans to market, uh, crayons, inks, a myriad of things that we've developed and, and are, are in the process of continuing to develop out a special product called soybeans. Well, Mr. Beard, thank you for joining us here at the Ag Media Summit. Thank you.